Hello there. Kenyans who were evicted from their land by British settlers during the colonial era plan to take Britain to the European Court of Human Rights. That's what their supporters said on Tuesday. Lawyers for those displaced from Kenya's Rift Valley say the British government has violated the European Convention on Human Rights by ignoring the victims and their grievances. The Kipsigis and Talai were evicted from their ancestral lands around Kericho in the early 20th century, a major tea growing region now farmed by large multinationals such as Unilever, Finlay's and Lipton. They took their case to the United Nations where in 2021 a panel of special counsels expressed serious concern that Britain has failed to publicly apologize or acknowledge its complicity in, in these colonial era grievances. Lawyers for the Kipsigis and Talai argued that British army and colonial administrators uh, used rape, murder and arson to take over large tracts of farmland in Caricho from the traditional owners. The victims, more than 100,000 signatories to the UN lawsuit filed in 2019, demanded an apology and compensation for the fact that their homeland was uh, usurped and assigned to white settlers who used the fertile soil to grow tea. However, lawyers said the UK government had refused to meet with the victims or their representatives. The victims' legal team said they had filed an application to the EU court, which had not been received as of Tuesday afternoon, although the European Court on, on Human Rights is not an EU court. Once the case is filed, a decision could be months or even years away. In June, the EU Court of Justice issued an interim ruling barring the UK from deporting asylum seekers to Rwanda. London has since introduced legislation that would allow the country to overrule the Strasbourg Court's decision, but has denied any intention of withdrawing from the European Convention on Human Rights, although I heard Liz Truss say something different. And once again, the European Court of Human Rights is not an EU court, so there's no misunderstanding here. I'll see you in my next video. I'll be back.